Welcome back to Synthetic Oil Protection. If this is your first time to the channel, you can subscribe by tapping the little red icon in the corner. Today, Jeff and I are gonna be going over all different techniques on getting your Uber and Lyft cars prepared for severe driving service. And uh, what are we gonna start out with first, Jeff? Well, we're gonna start out on this one with the uh, air conditioning because if you have a full charge of Freon, there's less drag on the compressor, less drag, better gas mileage. And uh, I believe we have some other services we're gonna do to this. Oh yeah. Okay, so I, I heard oil change, trans, trans transmission trans. fluid, all so kinds let's, of let's get a baseline. Now, uh, if everybody, let's zoom in here. All right. If you remember Jurassic Park, I believe the T-Rex is coming. Yes. I think with a good engine flush, some PI and the transmission service, that is not going to do that because we just have a little bit of a rough idle. It shouldn't be jumping like, it should be considerably smoother. All right. So what do we got here, Jeff? We got ourselves a brand new AC machine made by Robin Air. This is a uh, fully automatic. All we got to do is we're going to set the machine up to do the vehicle and we're just going to follow the instructions. That simple. So we're going to start by hitting auto. Okay, this stands for a, an electric compressor. If we were to uh, if we were to do a hybrid vehicle, which we can do with this machine, we would have to select yes. We're not going to do this today. It's not a hybrid. Okay, vacuum time. You want to pull a vacuum for 15 minutes to get the contamination and moisture out. Okay, um, easy. So here's my little book picture. We don't even have to work on this. 2015 Dodge. Grand Caravan. Able to identify a couple of the pipes that go down and backwards, which means we have air conditioning in the rear, so it is with rear AC. Boom. Tells me the total capacity of refrigerant is 2.538 pounds. This thing is amazingly accurate. That's incredible. So we're gonna hit go, and it automatically populates the charge weight. We still have 15 minutes. Uh, because I have so much pressure, I'm not going to worry about the leak check. If it was leaking, we would have a lot lower pressure. Now, we already have the high side hooked up just to make this a little quicker. But we're going to connect the low side hose, which is the blue hose with the small adapter. In, we're on, we're screwed down. Awesome. Lock tight. Beautiful. All right, so ask me if I want to save the service data. I don't care. All right. So do not save record. Okay. From here on out, the machine's going to take about a 30-minute cycle. It's going to take all the old refrigerant out. Wow. Okay? Runs it through three filters. Wow. Uh, after it does that, it's going to hold a vacuum on the system to get all the contamination out. And then once it's ready, it's going to charge the system with the exact amount of uh, refrigerant. So all the new refrigerant's going to be totally new and fresh. Yep. Awesome. Fresh as heck. And you know, I, I do know that they sell the cans of Freon at Walmart, AutoZone, and wherever else. Three Stooges or Pep Boys, I don't know. <laughs> um, but please don't sue me. That was not defamation. I promise. <laughs> so anyways, um, you can sell it like that, but um, if you try to install it yourself, you... You need vacuum time. You need to make sure Freon is put in by weight, not by volume. So a gallon of refrigerant doesn't exist. It's a pound. Mm. So unless you have a scale at your house to measure the Freon as it goes in, please take it to me. This service is 99 bucks. The cost of when you overcharge your system is about 1200 Oh my God, that's I'd much rather I'd rather see it do uh, 99 bucks with me. All right, that's right here on uh, Trop and Boulder Highway. All right, so everything's in progress. Tell us. Okay, so the system's getting ready to charge. It's reading the weight of the tank. Like I said, it has to be done by weight, not volume. Once it's done reading the weight, it's going to, oh, here we go. It's ah, charging. Look at that. Look at that. It charges fairly quick. There's one pound. It's only gonna take two point what? 2.368, something like that. All right, that's coming up real quick. Yeah. Seems it's charging really fast, which means we got a really good deep vacuum because it's pulling. It's not pumping the refrigerant in, the system's pulling it in, which also prevents you from overcharging mostly. Oh, wait, no. Oh, 436. Wow, look, it just stopped on that number. We have approximately eight feet of hose for the low hose and the high hose. So it has put the Freon in, but there's still Freon in the line. So what it's going to do, it says right here, it's going to tell us the next step. So it says, Press continue to hose equalize. We're going to continue. 
Disconnect high side service hose. Connect low side service hose. Start the air conditioner on max. So I'm going to disconnect this one right here. These caps cover your refrigerant service ports. If you do not put these on, your vehicle will leak out of that service port just a little bit, but how cool that a 10 cent cap can stop you from, you know, screwing up your AC. And there now she is. The hand. We got two options. We give it the hand test, or we just watch this little thing drop. Do you enjoy this video? If you did, definitely give it a thumbs up. That helps out my channel. Also, if you're new to the channel, you can tap the little red icon in the corner and then you'll be able to come back and watch these videos later. All right, so what's the verdict, Jeff? You know, it's 96 degrees outside. No, shit, 98. Oh my God. I'm sitting in here after working my ass off, cooling off. If this was my Lyft or Uber that came and picked me up and I'm dying on the strip, I'm happy as hell. This is some water, I'm going. That's a five-star rating in my book, yeah? And yeah. a 20% tip because I'm a nice guy. That's awesome. Love it. All right. That pretty much sums up the full AC service. If you guys are here in Las Vegas, you're an Uber Lyft driver, stop down. Jeff is the best guy in the world. He does magic, so check out his Insta game, right? That's right. He's always playing the game on there, doing magic tricks nonstop. What's oh. the name of your uh, your thing on there? Uh, uh, it's Plutonium Jeff. Plutonium Jeff. So and definitely. Then, uh, yeah. Look up that, and then uh, look up Jeff Lockett on Facebook. We're there, too, with Express Loop. And, uh, you know, well, I'll, give I'll give priority to Uber and Lyft drivers. They come here for some AC service. I will get you in and out. Service takes 45 minutes to an hour, depending on the condition of the system. So, uh, yeah, bring it down. We'll get you your five-star ratings, and uh, you'll awesome. have a good time. And also, Jeff can do everything else for your car, which you'll see in the future videos. You can tap this playlist of all the, the other videos, how to optimize your Uber car. And I'm gonna also put Jeff's shop location and his Google Maps right there in the, the uh, comment section. All right, cool. we'll see you guys. Thanks. Thanks.